Hey guys, just a really fast update on my doctor's office visit on Friday. Um, I'm sorry this has taken me so long to upload. Um, please forgive me, I just got out of the shower and um, I haven't done anything with anything. So, um, I had my doctor's appointment on Friday in the morning and uh, first thing was blood pressure. It was 106 over 66 and I told her that's a lot of sixes. Um, I didn't look at my weight. Um, I'm actually losing weight on my scale, and I hope it's not my scale, like, going kaput. It's pretty much new. I got it, my husband got it, um, right before we found out I was pregnant. So, sorry I'm burpy this evening. Um, so, uh, but yeah, it says that I'm kind of losing weight, which is interesting to me. But I did not check their scale, because I've decided to just stick with my own. Um... I went back, they checked me. I have not changed. I'm still one centimeter dilated, which is fantastic. I was so relieved to hear that because I am contracting a lot. Um, they also did the last fetal fibronectin test, which, like I said before, tests for markers of going into labor in the next two weeks. Um, so in two weeks, I will be 36 weeks five days. So um, that's encouraging. That test came back negative. So that means that I will more than likely make it to 37 weeks. I could still very much go into labor. Um, it's not totally accurate in that, but um, but chances are I will at least make it that far, uh, which whew, I'm just thrilled about, obviously. Um, I also got a flu shot. I have not heard of any other mommies on YouTube having this problem, but nobody, nobody would give me a flu shot. My kid's pediatrician wouldn't give me a flu shot. Walgreens wouldn't give me a flu shot. CVS wouldn't give me a flu shot. Nobody would give me a flu shot. So when I was at my doctor's office, I said, will you give me a flu shot? And so I got a flu shot there. Um... I also asked my doctor about the probability, sorry, I'm hearing motion over the monitor. Um, I also asked my doctor about the probability of her actually delivering me because now that she's at this new hospital, it is a drive. I mean, you have to get in your car and drive to this hospital, whereas the hospital I delivered at uh, with my last pregnancy was a skywalk away, so she could have she could be there in five minutes if she ran. Um, uh, she she told me a little bit about her schedule, and um, I basically have decided that I'm going to just set my mind that she is not going to be the one to deliver me. Um, excuse me, which is very upsetting to me. But I would rather prepare myself that it's going to be somebody else then really hold out hope that it will be her and then it not be. Um, I usually don't think like this, but in this case, I really need to start wrapping my mind around it. So then they sent me back out to the waiting room to wait for my ultrasound. And when I got back there, um, the first thing she did was comment about while we were walking. I just, I am walking really, really slowly, not just because of the contractions, but because I feel this baby so low that it almost hurts to, well, it hurts to walk. And the first thing she said was, I'm kind of surprised at how low you feel baby because it's still relatively high. My first thought was, great, great, so the pressure could get worse. That's, that's nice. Wow. Um, she was able to measure the entire head, which she said, you know, when babies are really low, she can't measure the whole head because it's obviously engaged. Anyway, um, so she was able to measure the head, the abdomen, and the, um, thigh bone and give a estimated weight. Now she said that this estimated weight is give or take a pound because the bigger the baby gets, the actually the harder it is to give an accurate weight. So she guessed 
this baby's weight at five pounds, 15 ounces, which is a week ahead, measuring a week ahead. Um, but at the same time, if I go into labor early, I'm really thrilled with that weight because, um, well, you know, six pounders, that, that's a good, that's a good size for, um, for an early preterm baby. Um, I also decided I'm giving this baby four weeks because at half, they, the baby should be gaining half a pound a week from this week on and four weeks would be seven pounds, 15 ounces. And I have delivered a seven pound, 13 ounce and seven pound, 14 ounce baby. So I figure I could do one more ounce. So, uh, baby is being evicted <laughs> in four weeks. Not really, but, um, in four weeks I'm going to do everything in my power to um, uh, be having a baby that's about ready to go. Um, what else? Everything looked good. Uh, they called to confirm that nothing seemed um, out of the ordinary. So I am thrilled with that visit. Um, I have another um, visit this Friday. Uh, like I said, I go weekly now. So um, that's pretty exciting. Um, guys, I hope this finds you happy and healthy and, um, I'll see you soon. Bye.